There's 104 days of summer vacation And school comes along just to end it So the annual problem for our generation Is finding a good way to spend it Like maybe Building a rocket or fighting a mummy Or climbing up the Eiffel Tower Discovering something that doesn't exist hey. Or giving a monkey a shower Surfing tidal waves Creating nanobots or locating Frankenstein's brain It's over here! Finding a dodo bird, painting a continent, or driving our sister insane. Idiot. As you can see, there's a whole lot of stuff to do before school starts this fall. Come on, Barry! So stick with us, cause Phineas and Ferb are gonna do it all. So stick with us, cause Phineas and Ferb are gonna do it all. Mom! Phineas and Ferb are making a title sequence! Hey, you know, kids, these fossils are of creatures that lived right here in Danville millions of years ago. Lucky these things aren't still here today. No, lucky would be if we weren't still here today. Oh, look, this T-Rex footprint was found not 30 yards from this very spot. Hey, and it says here that this fossil was dug up right near our very own neighborhood. Didn't we have a dog named Bucky who got sick and went to live on kindly old man Simmons' farm? Oh. Uh, let's move on, shall we? This next exhibit is kindly old man, Simmons. Hey! Who's up for milkshakes? Hmm? Gadgets through the ages. This exhibit was made for us, Ferb. Hey, what are all those people looking at? And this is one of our most curious pieces. A time machine made by a 19th century scientist named Xavier Onassis. But of course we know he never finished it, or else we'd still see him here today. <laughs> right, right, eh? Anyone? All right. Moving on. A time machine, huh? Ferb, I know what we're gonna do today. Right. Let's fix us a time machine. Hey, where's Perry? Agent P? Hey, it's me, Carl. The intern? We got a bit of a situation here. Major Monogram has been frozen like this pretty much all day. Solid as a rock. Oh, sorry. Anywho, if the Major were able to, I'm sure he'd say, well, ouch, first of all, am I right? <laughs> but seriously, I'm sure he'd say Doofenshmirtz was up to something and you should get to the bottom of it. Am I right, sir? <laughs> I'm gonna take that as a yes. Good luck, Agent P. And this fossil is the only representation of the Glycheolus species from the Jurassic era. How exciting! Ugh. Why do I have to endure this suffering while Phineas and Ferber off who knows where doing who knows? What are you doing? Fixing a time machine. <gasps> you